This video is to try and help on setup of SV3C cameras. My model is SVB01W-960P-HX, but I think the setup problem is pretty similar. You can see here user and password defaults to admin. Take your camera, plug it into an ethernet cable which is connected to your router. Make sure it's powered in. Get an outlet cover for your plug as well. Once you do that, head to your computer. Once you're at the website for SV3C, go to support, click download. You'll be taken to a page with a couple of different options, manuals, and app download. We want to click on PC software. I've got the HX series. You can see there's a number of them listed here. I click on HX series. I'm taken here. First thing I want to do is download the search tool zip number one. I've already done that. Once you do that, you'll end up with an icon. At least I had an icon. It's called search tool. Double click on that. Opens up. My dialog box here is kind of truncated or cut off. Uh, I know in the instructions there's a bigger screen, but that's not really important. I hit next. There's my camera. It's connected into my router. Double click it. It's going to take me to the designated IP address. Try that again. So once I get to the IP address, it's asking for this. As I mentioned, the default username and password are admin and admin. I click OK taken to this page uh, usually it's in Chinese just click on English to get it to English you may have to click set up software uh, when you initially set or get here I can't remember if I did I think I did click on PC view we can see my camera there's an image there it's recording something in my office uh, I'm gonna click on settings network wireless uh, make sure it's on for enable wireless. I click search. It picked up my Wi-Fi. These defaulted in. Key and retype key is just a Chinese way of saying your password. So that's where you type in your password, confirm your password, and hit apply. Uh, you can check wireless setup to make sure it's working on the system. Uh, and then you know if you're good to go. I can X out of this. I can click next here as well as I mentioned my dialogue screen or box here is cut off there is information in there if you look at the instructions I don't need it I don't think you will need it don't worry about it I hit cancel if I go back to the SV3 website um, I think if you download number four here the higher player setup or number two the client setup I can't remember which one it is but ultimately you'll be taking to uh, H2P2 client. This is just a way to view your camera on a PC. You can see mine is already set up. I've just picked one screen. You can pick multiple screens. This green plus sign here is where you add a device. When you go to add a device, it's going to ask for an admin and a password. I entered admin many, many times. Didn't work. Uh, then I left it blank and hit OK, and it was able to add. So it looks like on this area, there's no password to enter. Uh, once you've done this, you'll disconnect your camera from the Ethernet cable, and then using the app CamHigh or CamHigh Pro, you can go ahead and download uh, or get your camera running on the app. If you're having trouble, right here is the name or code for the camera that's specific to each camera. Uh, I was having an issue on the app getting it done. I entered that manually and it got the job done. But this is your initial setup and your next step is getting it on to your camera. Hope this helps.